Okay, everybody, we are at the expo. I'm late. Does anybody remember this? I can't with cow here. Move. <laughs> uh -oh. You got it. So the expo was a lot of fun and I'm going to show you what I picked up but before I do that I wanted to give a shout out to my friend Thomas from the Sweet Escape channel. He is a really nice guy and today is his birthday so go check him out. Go comment on his latest video and tell him happy birthday. I will link his channel below. Okay, so I am not going to be rehousing these or anything in this video because I just have way too much to do. The first new addition I got is a C. Hoggy. This is the Malaysian Purple Femur and it is an old world Asian fossorial. These grow to be really cool and purple if it's a female. If it's a male it will be like black and whitish, something like that. Not a lot is known about these. That's I think what really sparked my interest. It's just something different that I never heard of and I was super happy to pick this up from Ruth at Mostly Reptiles. Another really cool thing that I picked up from her is a P. Pulcher, Samuel Peus Pulcher. These are super cool. They are a New World Arboreal. And the main new addition that I have been wanting forever, the super spooky for October especially, is Emerald Skeleton Lake. I have been wanting one of these for so long. This is very similar to my E. Moranis but this one's green, so really cool. Someone also gifted me another pokey. It was very nice to see everybody, and thank you if you said hello to me. I always appreciate that. 
actually got a box from a subscriber. Okay. What I think we have here is supplies for my whip scorpion and my spiders. So this is awesome. We got a couple plants, which is perfect. This is Curly Willow, and he said that this should only be used in dry substrate because it will mold. So that is awesome. I will keep that in mind. And then this looks like the background for my scorpion's enclosure. Let's check it out. This looks awesome. Oh, nice. So you uh, included the Velcro too, and then this is the background, which he actually made this, you guys. That is so amazing. Thank you so much. This is really awesome, actually. So I appreciate it, and I will let you know how it turns out. I will also probably be stealing these plants for a couple of my new additions because I... Uh, I'm running a little low on fake plants here. We've been getting a lot lately, so. Okay guys, so there you have it. Not one, not two, not three, but four awesome new additions. Also, I wanted to show you guys the awesome enclosure that I put together for my new emerald skeleton leg really quick. I actually used to keep the Asian forest scorpion in here, Jinx, but I moved Jinx to a different enclosure. Um, a bigger one and this is like the perfect size so I'm gonna actually try to feed it real quick and see if we can and you can see it that it's already started to web up back here and it went right under this piece of cork bark which I actually bought this piece of cork bark specifically for this enclosure because it it reaches all the way over here like it's one big piece but it like goes up and then like under it is like the perfect like burrow all right no guarantees that this is gonna work Oh man. So yeah, that happened how I thought it was going to and it did not take it. But um, for some reason, it seems like when I get new additions, they aren't, like they don't take the super worms right away. And I guess it's just because they're used to eating something else. But um, it will find it, I'm pretty sure, because this is like a pretty good burrower so yeah okay thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed like this video if you did subscribe if you're not and you want to be and i will see you guys in my next video see ya